the victory of Jesus over the grave is your weapon against the spirit from the grave oh the victory of Jesus over death is your spiritual weapon against the spirit of death because you see the spirit of death is daring the spirit of death is fearless it will come oh the bible says for we wrestle not against flesh and blood against the spirit of death against principalities and powers against rulers of darkness and spiritual wickedness in the heavenly places but we have the victories the victories of jesus are in different levels it is important that we know what the weapons of god are the weapons of jesus each of the weapons addresses a certain issue for instance the bible says he was bruised for our iniquities so when iniquities come against you you lift up the bruises of jesus and say in the name of jesus i assess mercy come on i assess deliverance from iniquities by the bruises of jesus the christ no 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 no, no. hold on hold on be, be seated it says that he was wounded for our transgression he was wounded so uh, uh, the wound of jesus would not come against the spirit of death mm -mm. the bruises was for our iniquities come on he was wounded for our transgression the wound was for our transgression and now the bible says that the stripes on christ was for our healing the bible says by his stripes you are healed so when sickness comes against you and your family or on your loved ones you stretch your hands and say by the stripes of jesus my child you're healed i rebuke your spirit of infirmity come out of my child in the name of jesus the christ there is only one thing that pushes the devil back to the pit of hell it is called it is rhythm so you come before anybody afflicted with disease and thou shalt say it is written by his stripes my daughter is healed by the stripes of jesus my son is healed by the stripes of jesus i am healed therefore i rebuke you spirit of infirmity come out in jesus mighty name Somebody shout hallelujah. Let me sit it for one second. So if you look into the volume, into the depth, into the account of the victories of Jesus, there we can draw the weapons of our warfare. Oh, they didn't hear me right now. Are you hearing me now? You are not lost. You are not a victim because in the account in the volume of the victories of christ is our weapon against the foreign ducts of darkness i don't care how much of demons that have come against you just know what kind of demon is this one is it the kind of demons that comes against us will determine the kind of weapon we draw from the conquests of Christ Amen. the sting of the devil has no venom it is completely paralyzed it is powerless because of the resurrection of Jesus from the dead let me tell you something the victory of Christ on the grave is my victory against grave when Jesus came out of the grave I came out of the grave with him when he came out of the grave you came out of the grave with him glory to Jesus hallelujah sons of God 
You don't belong there. You have no business with grave. Oh, you don't hear me? I said, you have no business with the grave. Anytime you are in the dream and you find yourself in the grave, just wake up. I said, my DNA has no business. My family has no business. My tribe has no business. The nation I came from has no business with the grave. Hallelujah. Come on, come on. My citizenship is superior to grave. Whenever grave calls my name, I quickly lay hold on the weapon of the victory of Jesus over the grave. As my shield, come on sons of God, against the fire and darkness of grave against my family. Are you hearing me now? I will lift up the weapons of the spirit against the fire and darts of grave. Somebody say fire! Jesus said, I am the resurrection and I am the life. If you want to live and continue to live and not die, he says, I am the life. Go on and live, glory to God. And if, if you're dead, he said, oh, I'm the resurrection for the dead. In other words, we are no longer at the mercy of any circumstance. We are no longer victims. We are no longer complainers. We are victors. We are triumphant through him that has loved us. In Christ we don't die. In Christ we live as long as we live and exit the earth by revelation. Glory to God. For those of you that desire to die, he is your resurrection. <laughs> For those of you that desire to live, he's the life. For me, me and my sons, uh, me and, and my household, we have decided to lay hold on eternal life and live as long as we desire. Grave, where is your victory? Death, where is your sting? For Jesus is a victory over grave. Shout hallelujah! From today forward, anything dead in your body by the resurrection power of the Jesus of Christ, I command everything dead in your body back to life. Back to life. Back to life. Back to life. I'll be seated. Is so why Jesus was going through his tough times. The very man who led him to it died. Hear me out. Every Judas that betrayed Jesus, Jaluko Paradiko Paradash. Every Judas, because Judas was the one that led to the arrest, bruises destruction and death of jesus lift your hands up anybody monitoring your destiny as you are raised from the dead that person will take the place of your grave 